Good morning, Fulton High School. This is Emily Langford with a few words of wisdom. Here's an important question. So listen up. How do you like to be treated? Do you like to be treated with kindness? Do you like to be treated with respect? Do you like it when someone smiles at you or gives you a big hug or listens carefully to what you have to say? Most of you would give an enthusiastic yes to all of these. Now ask yourself this question. How do I treat others? Do I treat others with kindness? Do I treat others with respect? Am I generous with my smiles and hugs? Do I listen to others when they speak? Former President John F. Kennedy once said, every American ought to have the right to be treated as he would wish to be treated. Today, remember the golden rule and treat others only as you would want to be treated. With something to think about, this is Emily Langford. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. Let's take a look at some highlights from Friday night's game. is homecoming here at FHS. Several of our teachers are also alumni. Here are, here are Miss Newton and Coach Bell to share some homecoming memories. So as a Flomiston graduate, I guess my favorite homecoming memory is definitely the float building and coming together as a group and getting together at someone's house and building the floats and having the pep rallies on Thursday nights and having, we used to have a bonfire and come together as a group, as a class, and have a bonfire where we would do a big pep rally, a big class group, kind of what we do now, which we do tailgating, but we would kind of do it as a different type of thing where we would um, 
get together and have a big bonfire and have a big pep rally where all the school would come together and we would do this big um, burning boxes and do fun things together but we do a fun thing now we like it and it was just mainly the whole group of the school coming together and getting ready for the game on Friday night we did a lot of fun things like that every day so it's probably my best memory uh, homecoming is something that's very special for me especially being a, an alum of Fulton High School I, I can remember of course, all the, the times going out, float building, you know, toilet paper and all that kind of stuff that everybody loves to do. But my favorite memory of homecoming was, I believe it was my ninth or my 10th grade year at the Flomington homecoming parade. We were downtown, uh, all the football players, we had, you know, done the pep rally that day um, and we had gotten out of school early and we all made our way downtown to watch the parade. And they had all the standard floats, you know, the fire trucks and the police officers and everything like that. And of course they had the, the homecoming attendants and all that. And then the cl different clubs on campus had their own floats or cars as well. And I can remember the FFA car was driven by Paul LaSalle. He had a T-top Firebird at that time. And he was driving the car and two guys, I believe it was Chad Payne and I don't remember who the other one was. The Chad Payne and this other guy were sitting in the T-top and they had their plastic bags and it looked like they were throwing candy. And the more that I started to look, the more I realized they weren't throwing candy. Because I would watch little kids run after what it was that they were, were throwing and they'd reach over and pick it up in the street and all of a sudden they'd Gah! go like that and throw it. And they were throwing Vienna sausages out of the can. They were opening up cans of Vienna sausages and throwing them and they you know how vine sausages are a little wet coming out of the can they would throw them and hit the ground and rocks would stick to the vine sausages and little kids are going up picking up these vine sausages covered in rocks and hair and all this other kind of nasty mess and throwing them down and it was the funniest thing i've ever seen in my life somebody that thought up throwing vine sausages out of a car at homecoming is a legend the volleyball teams will play tomorrow at central beginning at 5 p.m the JV football team will play at XL with kickoff at 6.30. Homecoming activities Friday will begin with the parade at 2 p.m. and pregame at 6.30. The game against Chickasaw will kick off at 7 p.m.